Hi, I'm Darcy Drollinger, and this is Hot Trash. Our top trash, 2020 claims yet another victim. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the final Hot Trash. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I know, I know. I'm sorry you had to find out this way. I should have told you sooner. My bad. The reality is, well, we need to keep the Oasis alive here in San Francisco. It's been amazing to have the opportunity to hire this fabulous crew, but, well, we just don't have the money to make hot trash and save the Oasis. I, I wish we could do both. This show has gotten me through some pretty dark times, and, well, I know there'll be more dark times ahead, but without, I don't know, say like a White Claw sponsorship or about 150 more Patreons, we just can't afford to... Oh, hold on a second. I actually have to take this. Hello? Please hold for Mr. Whiteclaw. Darcy, this is Bob Whiteclaw, founder and CEO of Whiteclaw Hard oh Seltzer. Oh my God, Mr. Claw, what an honor. We, we love your hard seltzer here at Hot Trash. And we love your hot trash. How would you like a full sponsorship? Yes! yes! Oh my God. And... We'll fly you out to film in our studio in L.A. Oh, my God! Yes! Oh, my God! And you get a fabulous new professional crew. Yes! Uh, what? Well, you see, Bob, can I call you Bob? Look, I already have a fabulous crew, and, well, while they may not be professionals by any stretch of the imagination, they're the best at what they do, and, frankly, all I've got. I mean, I couldn't do hot trash without them. It's just you or there's no deal. Then they're gone. See ya, bitches. What? I'm going to LA. Hot to trash, hot to trash. Cut the budget to me, cause you got the new key. Yeah, hot to trash, hot to trash. So hot to. And now, talking trash. Cut. Okay, skirt's too short, hair's too big. Let's get wardrobe in here. Action. And now, talking trash. Cut. Less hands. And now, talking trash. Cut. No hands. And now, talking trash. Brilliant. All right, moving on. Trump nominates ultra-conservative Amy Coney Barrett to replace Ruth Bader Ginsburg on the Supreme Court. I mean, that's like nominating a Twinkie to replace Crim Berlay. You know she's in the Handmaid's Tale religious cult, right? I mean, if he had moved that fast on COVID as he did to fill the Supreme Court seat, we could all be out enjoying the fall foliage right now. I love a good maple. And how about the New York Times bombshell about Trump's business failures and decades of unpaid taxes? I mean, he wrote off $70,000 for hair treatments. And this is the hair he got? Girl, please, call a queen. I'm sorry, but if my tax dollars are paying for that rat's nest, I want it bigger, I want it bolder, and way more gay. Now that is a $70,000 hairdo, hunty. Oh, cut! And cut! All right, what was that at the end there? What was that? The oh, Right. Well, the you, oh, cr comes before. Okay, well, it occurs to me that we shouldn't do that, all right? Let's stick to the script. But that was great, Darcy. Really, really good. Solid, Thanks, solid. Thanks. But um, we should be a little more balanced in our coverage, you know, not quite so provocative, because this is a news show, after oh. all. Uh, uh, no, it's not, actually. It's commentary. I mean, it is commentary, you know, like Tucker Carlson's show, which a judge just ruled is not a credible source of news when he dismissed former playmate Karen McDougal's defamation case. Uh-huh, great, yeah. And we can't say Twinkie because we're owned by Hostess and Creme Brulee is testing too French for our audience, all right? So stick to the script, all right, tally-ho, cheers, thanks a lot. Um, oh, okay, but like, I mean, on Hot Trash, I mean, we used to riff sometimes, you know, and kind of just throw some stuff around, play, find the funny together. And look what happened to Hot Trash. Oh my, wow. And action! Oh, oh, and now for Celebrity Bitch Slap! Mm. Cut too violent. Less slap. And now, celebrity bitch slap. Cut even less slap. Oh. 
And now, celebrity bitch slap. Cut, no slap. Okay. And now, celebrity bitch slap. Cut, slap just with your face. <laughs> and now, celebrity bitch slap. <laughs> that was brilliant, perfect. Moving on, Tally Waka. It's the singing smackdown of two dueling divas, Gladys Knight versus Patti LaBelle. Ha! So, legendary divas Gladys Knight and Patti LaBelle recently appeared on Versus, the showdown show produced by Timberland. But instead of a battle royale, these two served up some delicious diva renditions of their classic hits. They were thrilled to share the stage together, and even Dion Warwick stopped by for a visit. Okay, you know what? I'm sorry. Can we pause here? This is supposed to be celebrity bitch slap. I mean, the people don't want celebrities getting along. They want the drama, you know, the, the tea, the, the juicy, juicy gossip. Look, unless one of these snatch the other one's wig off, I don't think this is going to work. No, no, actually, if you want a good one, I got a good one for you. What about Drew Barrymore and Tom Green reuniting on the set of her talk show 18 years after their divorce? I mean, I hear it was super awkward, but then again, the whole show's kind of awful. I mean, have you seen that turd? When I usually fill out medical forms and they ask, is there a possibility you're pregnant? Pregnant? I'm usually like, uh, nah, you chance. But now she's making me rethink and get scared and curious and wonder. Listen, this mama python, she got it done. And although it is certainly suspicious how, I say, live your bliss. We interrupt the regularly scheduled program to bring you hot breaking trash. This just in, Hope Hicks tests positive for COVID-19. Oh my God. This just just in, Melania hates Christmas and children. I mean, have you listened to those tapes? Sounds kind of grinchy if you ask me. <gasps> this just 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 in, Trump and Melania test positive for COVID. OMG. <gasps> this just 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 in, Trump airlifted to hospital. Oh my God, that is not good. White House Rose Garden Super Spreader event? Trump gives awkward photo op at Walter <coughs> Reed. Is that a cough? <coughs> Wait, Kellyanne has it. Chris Christie has it. Kaylee McEnany has it. Try to say that name three times fast. Oh my God, Trump does a COVID lap around the hospital. All cap Twitter storm, what the fuck? This just, 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 just in. Trump released from hospital. Trump tweets, don't worry about COVID, and we're right back where we started. This is too much trash. I can't handle the trash! Hey, Doris. Oh my God, snacks, it's you, I can't believe it. And you're wearing nails and and heels? Oh God, I missed you so much. I miss all the trashies. It's so freaking weird here. How are you, Snacks? How you doing? Um, no, thank you. I'm not hungry. Um, my name is Stefani. I'm from the People Team. That's pronounced Stefani. My pronouns are she, her, hers. Me, mine. Welcome to the White Claw family. Wait, so you're not my fabulous sidekick? Uh, no, and actually that term is offensive. Um, I prefer the term executive assistant to the drag arts talent, or eat dat for short. Um, okay, well, speaking of eat dat, eat dat, do you want to eat dat savory SpaghettiOs jello mold over there? It looks really gross! Um, no, I'm vegan. Um, are those cocktail weenies even cruelty free? I sure as hell help not. <sighs> Go for Stefani! Oh, hey, can somebody get me a vodka soda? Um, it's 11 a.m. Could someone give me a shot? It's 11.05. Chill tequila? Could someone give me a beer? It's 11.06. Fine, I'll take a White Claw. Could I get a mango? Could someone open this for me? Could I get a straw? And action! And now it's time for Bobbing for Drag Names. 
Today's recipients get an extra special treat because we've attached their new drag names to some of these balls bobbing in the water. <laughs> I love balls, especially when they're wet. Let's name some new queens and kings. This one's for Ben. Your new drag name is Misdemeanor. Are you studied for prison? Dawn, your new drag name is Christian Rock. No, I always hear your prayer. Josh, your new drag name is Celine Peon. <laughs> and there you have it. All you have to do is Venmo me $20 and I'll give you a drag name. Here's me, here's my Venmo, your drag oh, name. We're not doing drag names anymore, so we don't need the Venmo. Well, well, but, but people can still support Oasis. Any amount helps. If, if you like what we're doing and, and want to show your support, Venmo me or, or, or better yet, join our Patreon. Help save Oasis and keep San Francisco queer. All right, but, that's great. But can you just say buy more White Claw instead? Are you fucking serious? You know what? Never mind. We'll just get the Beth bot to make a graphic. Ah! I love graphics. I love Photoshop. I love white claw. I get it! Okay, that was great, but I want to make one change. Oh, it's my iPhone 11 Pro, available at T-Mobile. I'll get it! Hello? <laughs> it's a social media shout out. Here are the winners and losers on our corporate sponsors, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, this week. What is this, honey? This is where you live, honey. Let me see what's going on. Ooh, let me see. <laughs> I was shocked, honey. I was in tears almost. And it has a white refrigerator. I was like, oh, oh, not a white refrigerator. Girl, please put your shoes on. Let's go find you a home, honey. Oh, Lord. I threw up. I saw the ring and I threw up. That's not normal. That's my reaction to marriage. What do you think you might do if he asks? I don't know. Just say yes. It hasn't been long enough. What did the ring look like? Well, that's the other thing. That's the only way. Miss Cosgrove, Miss Cosgrove, wild night last night, huh, Miss Cosgrove? <laughs> Listen, try to stay with us for the class. The economic structure that was set up and put in place in the United States after the Industrial Revolution became a kind of, what's the word, uh, Miss Cosgrove. Miss Cosgrove, wow. Wild nights. Next up, Hollywood trash. Hot, fewer snaps. Okay. Next up, Hollywood trash. Hot, fewer snaps. Next up, Hollywood trash. Hot, no snaps. Next up, Hollywood trash. Okay, we'll live with it. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Tom Hardy is rumored to be replacing Daniel Craig as the new James Bond. But wait, I mean, what about the rumors that black actress Lashana Lynch was going to be the new 007? I mean, honey, that's a Bond movie I want to see. Okay, that was great, but can you please stick, stick to the script? I got it! Mm. Oh, hey, hey, you got any poppers? You know your mic is on, we can't hear you. Hey, Jars, I want to introduce you to your music team that'll be creating your parody songs. Oh my god. You look just like Zelda and Steve. My name is N. And this is DJ Booger Sugar. Um, they're platonic cat co-parents, not a couple. And they have some great ideas for some songs that you can lip sync to in this episode. Mm. Go for Stefani!
but um, do you guys know any Brittany? Uh, qu'est-ce que c'est Brittany? Qui est ce bimbo? Lunch here? We never got lunch in hot trash. No food for Darcy. She's on a diet. Um, I am. Hello, Gretchen from the image team. Darcy, we really need to work on your Instagram numbers and what's up with all these mean comments on your TikTok? <laughs> well, I'm sort of an acquired taste. Well, so is White Claw, but we made a billion dollars last year. Um, <clears throat> Look, it's really funny, but you remind me of my friend Sophia, and I always thought she was an asshole, but what's crazy is, like, you're a total asshole. I mean, it really makes me miss her a lot. I'm telling HR. Oh, my God! You have HR and lunch? We never had either of those things on hot trash. I mean, cut, bleep, SFX, jump cut. Cut! You're not supposed to read everything on the teleprompter! Shut! You're bollocks! Honey, you're a lifesaver. You know your mic is still on. <laughs> and in trash that came out this week. Kim Cattrall's new show, Filthy Rich, just dropped. It's sort of like Samantha Jones had a southern accent and was married to Jerry Falwell Jr. But instead of the pool boy scandal, his plane crashes and she might have done it. He said planes just don't fall out of the sky. They do if God wants them to. Yep, she did it. And by the way, Cynthia Nixon, who is currently on Ratchet So Good, along with Sharon Stone, just said that Sharon Stone would make a great Samantha Jones if they ever made the third Sex in the City movie they've been talking about. Clearly, Cynthia has never seen this Samantha Jones. I mean, honey, please. Isn't it hard to just eat organic all the time? No, it is so hard. Last night, I wanted a Big Mac so bad, I had to get up, get dressed, go out, and pick up a guy. <laughs> <laughs> but you can see it all on Oasis TV, along with these fabulous shows that you know and love, in drag! Cut! Cut! What is she doing? What now? You can't handle the power trash! Yeah! Fashion Nova has just released a kid's line! So little girls and even some little boys can look as cheap and fabulous as me. Isn't that great, Stefani? Oh, I wouldn't be caught dead in Fashion Nova. What's wrong with Fashion Nova? Nothing, if you're into that sort of thing. I am in to that sort of thing. Okay? You know what? That's it. You people may have tons of money and a fabulous studio and great clothes and all the freaking White Claw you can drink. Actually, could I get another one? Thanks. Mango. But you know what? You're snobs. Your corporate culture sucks, and hot trash is all about fun. You know, making fun of the fucked up world. So you know what? I would rather be poor and happy doing what I love with my friends than be rich and miserable doing iPhone ads with you jerks. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna finish this damn episode with the people I love. I may be hot trash, but I'll never be hot or trash! I'm taking the Twinkies too! 
Hot Snots! Hot Snots! She's the star of the show! There's no Darcy anymore! Hot Snots! Hot Snots! It's Snots! Thanks for watching Hot Snacks with Snacks! I'm Snacks! Please like and subscribe, and we'll see you next week. But before we go, here's one last snack. Wait, stop, stop, ah! stop! I'm back, everybody! Hot Trash is back together! Yeah! Does that mean we get to continue the show? Hell no, I still can't afford to pay you people. Look, but we've got the Oasis, and we've got each other. But all I really want to know is, Snacks, how do you feel about the Fashion Nova kids line? Oh my God, I'm so excited about it. We did a whole segment about it on Hot Snacks with Snacks. Thank God. Well, actually, honey, you haven't because you're canceled. <laughs> but we've been canceled together. And we do have a lot of great stuff happening at the Oasis. We sure do. So come down and visit us or, or show some love on our Venmo or Patreon or both. Well, girl, what do you say? One more for old time's sake. One last trash. Oh, grrr. Don't worry, we'll be back. Come on, Bubba, come on.